so lovely waking up to colder weather. The air that fills your lungs feels so reinvigorating yet inviting to cozy up and have another cup of your warm drink. Slowing down, taking one thing off our not immediate to-do list and indulge in moments of wonder. Ironically enough, while we are witnessing nature letting go of what no more serves and prepares to rest, we seem to be doing quite the opposite, trying to pack in as much as possible, turning these last few months of the year from restful to the busiest. We believe we're living better, we're making more money, only to see what our money can buy by December 25th, cramming in activities, places and reunions to attend. But the real enjoyment of the colder seasons does not come from a checked off bucket list. The perfect wishing list, so gift, it happens fruitfully only when we allow ourselves to wonder, to observe, to tune in with ourselves and our values. When was the last time that we prioritized rest during these months? To recharge and finding those new energies in rest. So why don't we start from the kitchen? Because to me, it's the best way as a minimalist to enjoy a season to involve all of our senses. Let's prepare something to taste autumn today and enjoy it with a healthy twist to a very popular drink. I quit sugar about three years ago and I still see the results today. So in a home, we use honey, maple syrup, coconut sugar and dates in this case to sweeten anything that would normally require sugar so here's a pumpkin spice syrup that i can indulge into and you can too <laughs> 